Okay, just gonna go through some blitzy type stuff. Uh, we encountered quite a lot of strong players yesterday. So it was quite interesting seeing how they operated. Really good, really strong. <laughs> um, probably maybe a bit too strong, but hey, what can you do? Let's just uh, castle here. Let's just develop. Looks like our opponent's just um, moving pieces, so just move pieces as well. They may be looking to find good positions as well. That's something I need to operate. And uh, he's closing down our center, so see if we can lock in this bishop. Where can the knight go? Knight can always come back here. He's going for a lot of um, extension. Let's push on to the bishop like we planned. We were planning this side, but it doesn't make a difference. Let's push here. And I'm looking to see if I can take advantage of this, these gaps, but it doesn't look like I'm going to win out at this moment. So, I'm just going to gently push on here. I think we'll lose out, but we can get the rook if he does take, so he doesn't take. And let's just push here now. These pawns are so extended. Maybe we can start doing something towards their king side. And let's grab. And grab again. So opening up a bit of space towards his king. And the knight, if we could, we could just put a touch onto the king here. King moves and we could take the knight, but I think I'm gonna bring, oh, no, oh, don't steady on. <laughs> bring the queen here. Uh, he's attacking our bishop, he's also attacking the bishop again, so I think we're going to run out of time here, overthinking big style. Let's go here with the knight. I think if his knight takes our bishop though, then we do have a bit of an issue because he wins our bishop with his rook. But I'm actually going to take, I think there's something, I think there's something that can be done. Let's just bring the knight up, attacking the rook. I'm trying to use the advantage of this space around the king because the other pieces aren't developed. So he's going for long pause thinking. So he's moved out of the way. So we could now just bring the queen here. Now he's feeling the pressure. So we're going to have to do something a bit dramatic. Knight could come here putting a check on the king because the queen doesn't have any support. But I suppose he could come back and protect. But he doesn't. So we can take the queen for free. And then put a check on the king. He does have the pass pawn, so we want to get rid of this pass pawn. Uh, in the meantime, let's just put a check on the king here. Let's bring this rook up, see if we can get some sort of action going. He's going to want to hide. He's still putting pressure onto our king area. That pawn's going to drop. What do we do? Oh, oh. Um. I'm not really a fan of this type of situation. Let's go here. I'm looking for the queen to come here. He's not actually doing any of that. So I'm going to put a check on the king here. I don't know if that works. Does it work? And do we get a queen or something? Okay. Well, that was a nice first match. Um, I think we highlighted what the, area, <coughs> the areas we were looking to attack. Whoa, that's a bit bright. Whoa, steady on. Yeah, so from the get-go, we're trying to put pressure onto the king area as best possible. Look, scrappy. Um, I'm not too bothered about scrappy in terms of um, if it's moving towards developing pressure towards the king or on finding better positions. I'd rather it look scrappy and effective than um, beautiful and not effective. So we saw all these pawns pushing down towards our king area. So it's a strength in a way because yeah, it makes you think and panic that, oh my God, they're crushing your king. But at the same token, they are overextending. I'm not saying I played these moves the best. Let's have a look at the gauge bar thing. Okay, so it's showing that we're okay at the moment. I just want to see if there's any major dips. And uh, well, it's saying the knight should have taken the bishop. Okay, either way. Right, so we're st still minus four at this moment. We're looking for the major dip. So they're pushing forward with the pawns. And like we said, there's potentially some way in. 
I don't think we played it the best because we did lose a piece but we'll see how we go so then they push down we push forward we capture 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 so that's okay it's at this point somewhere where I thought we might have messed up a little bit so we went with the check with the king that seemed pretty straightforward and then the queen move um, we didn't lose any potatoes there okay oh we didn't lose anything really okay, so it's minus seven so it's minus eight now when they've done that minus nine now right so we didn't need to worry about that maneuver at all um this knight move wasn't the favorite at all so pushing through here well during those times it's you know when your time's filtering away finding these small moves like this here I want that didn't even come into my mental roller decks. Although it's showing minus 11 now, so hold on. Oh, yeah, it was the night move. It didn't like the night move. Okay, so minus 8. And look at that big drop. I thought there was something not quite right. Although we felt okay. Um, but yeah, it's nice to do evaluation. Minus 9 to then minus 0 0.7. That's a massive drop. So it was looking at this center pawn here, looking to open up the center. So we, we should stick with the mantra in these sort of situations, just push through the center nice and steady. I think when we've got these types of um, attack positions, I'm looking to try and really crush the king as best possible. But I think I've got to learn to just sit back a little bit more, look even more logically. Yeah, okay, that's nice, that's nice. That is something I, I could put into my mental roller decks quite nicely, just slotting that in there. Take a bit of a rain check once the big attacks have been gone. There was nothing definite really with the move that I'd made, so I can see why that um, evaluation bar has gone down a bit. Okay, so then they bring the rook back. So after this point, then it's um, pretty straightforward. Yeah, so I don't really have any concerns about this part, unless of course it does a major dip somewhere, but no. Yeah, so that queen move was the, the only failing thing. So it's just looking at the smaller moves once you've done your big attacks. Interesting.
strange a lot of these games recently are getting to the time flagging thing or rubbish positions from the opponent but they're still ending up winning i've got a lot of questions on these games i'm playing recently a lot of questions I am playing some absolute terrible chess absolutely terrible chess I can't blame the players now what's happened here did they resign oh what was that that's silliness yeah I'm playing some rubbish chess I'm giving people advantages left right and center is this the the week where I'm I've just got to let it go I've just got to get it out of my system absolutely terrible chess let's go here it's got to be the worst chess for about a year i'm playing at the minute didn't think he was going to exchange uh... you know what I'm looking for this type of position Come on, if they were moving quick, they'd have taken the night. Hey, yeah. I cannot believe the. Ooh. It's got a double whammy with that situation, then, hasn't he? Taking down quite a lot of pieces. Oh man, resign. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not wearing that. Not with the amount of players I've been playing, and they've been kicking my butt. Let's get back in again. Let's get the kick butters in there. They're so strong, or I'm making them look strong. Unbelievable play. Okay. Is this player not playing? Oh, they've moved, they've moved, they've moved. See Daisy, <laughs> got myself kind of trapped up there.
Down on time, man. Down on time, big star. I'm stuck. No, I'm not stuck anymore. One ten, one ten. Looks like this guy's a bullet specialist. Okay, getting lucky in these last few games now. Must be warming up to the idiotic, idiotic play that I've been playing recently. Damn, going straight back in, I don't care. Let's go. one of them slow plodding machine type playing things Oops, I'm, I need to stop doing pre-moves type things. I lose advantages. Yeah, I need to look at this play. Don't over guess.
Yeah, what's happening here? I expected them to take that pawn, but I thought I had something special. More special than what I think I have here. Yep, so that last game, miscalculation. And losing a little bit of a pawn here, but I'm hoping there's some sort of positional benefit to me actually letting that pawn get taken. I'm thinking there was something, but it's probably not worth writing home about I don't think so as a chess player I'm, I'm willing to lose I'm willing to I really want to evaluate my game playing the blitzy type stuff really isn't my bag as we know but see if we can oh he's let us have this thing here so we've got ownership of the file well feels like ownership but my pieces are a bit clumped up here so he's going to be challenging the rook yes let's go here I think this is I don't know why this is looks like the key square only because his king is there at the minute and I think he's seeing the same thing he's also attacking our pawn so I could defend with the king or defend with the queen but then his rooks are going to come across yeah, let's do that his rooks are going to come across so we end up losing out in owning the file per se just going to take it anyway and then just move here has he landed on anything with this queen move it's coming down for a, a little measly pawn it's also coming down for the knight so we could come here with our knight just to defend let's just bring the knight here And we could attack. Oh, they've resigned. There's something wrong with the position, potentially, because we could just take his knight here and we've got a two on one. But he could take the pawn, but we've got a two on one. Queen could have taken that type of situation. Okay, let's get bouncing back in again. Right, let's see if we can get to 1600 then. Okay, this is the focal point. Let's focus. Uh, we could take, let's just go here. So we're on 1539. Let's see if we can get to 1600 in Blitz. Yeah, seems fair to me. Let's attack the queen. Attacking this pawn. <clears throat> queen has to take itself back. Looks like the opponent may have left the game. Okay, well, I'll take them. I'll take it no problems yeah okay next one track to 1600 in however long it takes come on let's do this now let's just take that bothersome night pawn uh, there is a situation let's go here I knew that 
fancy sort of stuff was coming and then the night drops in oh let it drop in let it drop in or takes the pawn whichever oh it doesn't do that just yet it's waiting let's go here and what have they done resigned bad move order okay right next one we're on track to the 50, 1600 come on what are we on now 1549 let's keep plodding away then I don't care how we get the um, advantages let's just keep throwing stuff out why do people do that move let's go here What's the deal with that? Oh, we're gonna get squished. King areas already under threat, but don't let the creative. Oh, shh. That's okay. I thought that had support on it then. They're moving a bit too fast. I think I'm falling for something. Has it got me? Bishop there. Let the queen go here. Go on, go on, I dare you. Go on. That's where he wanted to go. Um what do I have? Don't overthink it. He's got my pawn. Life. Not today. Maybe something else. Another pawn. My crikey. I'm giving. Oh, here we go. Let's go here. I don't have any checks on his king. Don't look. He's got. Get, grabbing pawns. It's getting on my nerves. Let's go here. Come on, we're on track for the 1600. Has he landed on anything? No, he's not landed on anything. Should we get rid of this queen? It's getting on my nerves. He should take now his up pawns, isn't he? Oh, plus one. What happened there? Uh, oh, are they getting desperate? Can trade down his upper pawn it's not trading oh it's landed on the bishop yes that's exciting one fifty Did he move? Did he move? Oh no, my microphone is gone. Oh, I've created havoc. Right, I'm gonna lose on time. Hold on. What am I on? winning something what happened to that did he just take a pawn or something sacrifice grab a bishop Rooks down. Rooks gonna take. Oh, 
59 seconds I need not dance now Oops. Come on, move. Yay! What are we on now? 1540. 1554. Okay, so we've got a few more yet to get through up to the 1600. Let's just keep cracking on. <laughs> oh, aggressive. All huffy. It's got two and one there, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. Let's get there. Oh, let's uh, grab that. <clears throat> Actually, I think I missed the trick there. Silly me. I could have just gone here with the queen earlier. Now I've let his knight out. Silly me. Well, don't overthink it, maybe. <laughs> Missed opportunity. I'm not sure what that was. Wow, we're cleaning up a bit quick here, aren't we? Okay, so that's going to be 1560 now. 40 points away from 1600. Maybe we should just take a little bit of a break and then come back. Yeah, or should we carry on because we're on fire? No, I think we're going to take a break. Um, let's grab them Castle You know I'm feeling like opening up Yeah
He's got gonna get a two on one here, isn't he? So we need to move a bit lively. So his rook should have probably come here to attack that pawn. And we're gonna have issues, aren't we? He's looking for this pawn. Could actually take a pawn with his bishop country because he's on my knight <laughs> as we speak. <laughs> oh dear me, why am I falling for all this stuff? It's unreal. So he's got a pawn up because of that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's do that. Guys, full of tricks. Oh, I think they messed that up then. Oh my days. Oh, I just said they were full of tricks as well. Oh, bummer. Okay. Ah, okay. Forty-seven seconds. Wow, these seconds are going down a bit quick, aren't they? I think that was a bit lucky actually I think they did have some sort of trickery going on but they, I don't know if they messed up the move order unless of course I'm talking out of my just um, that night maneuver thing somewhere keep going Right, yeah, blacks out and out winning at this state. I might as well do it from the beginning, aren't I? Shocking. 
yeah didn't feel brilliant in this at all a little bit sketchy really I need to get back into the zone <clears throat> it's because it's fast fast play you know it's um, hard for me to gauge it's too quick I need to move faster but then the moves I'm making aren't really the appropriate moves look at that blacks winning here shady look, very shady look at the position positions rubbish Ugh. so we grabbed and yeah we're losing point yeah we did say you could do that yeah very fancy very fancy so we captured resigning ourselves to that so they're winning at this moment so we start to double up a little bit double up again and he goes for another bit of cleverness yeah so that's the cleverness it was um it was clever but then they did that so yeah them taking there would have been better i think it's showing them ad advantageous there yeah and then rook takes yeah so it's still rooks and i probably would have still been able to play on ish it's just he's got more more pawns on this side they'd have to and put more pawns on that side so they will, would be winning out but they didn't play that so yeah so it was just one small error nice one target 1600 in this particular sitting we'll see if we can do it we're trying to um what's the word now get our balance back from the bad days bad days of chess let's not do that one let's do this one concentrate on the time factor it's not a long play game bring this back you know I, I don't like this it looks good for what um white and, and even when black does it as well but I don't it's like a lazy man's support for the bishop and just taking this off here make a decision he's not going to take with his bishop because he wants us to take so the rook opens up that file even when we push onto the bishop he's still not going to take but he wants this pawn to open up see what i mean and the knight's defending this pawn so that's all good so let's just x-ray through onto the rook don't overthink it again taking the knight opens up the pawn in front of our own king area so again it's a bit dangerous isn't it so probably trying not to fall for any of that and just bring the rook across opposite their queen yeah so he's definitely looking to try and face off our king i'm not taking the knight i'm not interested and pushing here takes 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 i don't think i want to entertain any of this sort of play but i'm overthinking now i need to make a move i need to make a move that was too much thinking now he's attacking our bishop I'm trying not to open up our king area, but uh, we'll see how it transpires. <laughs> it's not going for that. It's still trying to open up our king area. Look at him, he's just relentless take 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 is it going to be that bad it, it is going to be that bad yeah man I should have done something earlier maybe still going 
Still going. My life. Relentless attack towards the king area. We knew it was coming. I don't think we did enough to sort it out, you know. Can I not take it? Is it my go? Oh, it's not my go. Stop. Shame. I thought it was my go. Oh no, I'll take him there, aren't I? Yeah, I ain't got much here. Uh, that's a shame. Take Rook comes down. Get the king here, try and get it out of the way. Try and get it out of the way as best possible. Maybe I'll up and down. Ooh, up and down there. Uh, so just. It's got my pawn. It's not taking the pawn. So he's dancing now. He's probably looking to just flag me now. So let's just move the king out of the way. Bishop's got the pawn here. And he's not going for that pawn either. Let's attack this rook. 48 seconds, there's not much that can be done in 48 seconds, let's go here what was that? bishop attacking the rook pawn and the rook 40 seconds takes the pawn need to get all our pieces over to this side now if we can he's just taking everything now Twenty-five seconds. Nope, don't do that. Nope, don't do that. You gotta give it to him, aren't you? Gotta give it to him. Jeez. Jeez, 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 jeez. So I'd expect to come onto a site and play against human people, not play against the computer. Let's move so that I can take this here. to worry about that one too much <laughs> must surely have lost the night now must surely 
Got my life, there's two nights, I must be getting one of them with the king. He can't come out of any magic now. For the next few then I'm going to do without narrative. Uh, yeah, about time. So, which was which is the one that's going to cause me the most trouble? Let's get this one out of the way. Yeah, thank you very much. There. Okay, appreciate the appreciate the kind words. Let's grab here. Let's come here. That's right. That's right. Keep moving fast. Come on. Let's just come here. We take and let's just grab this let's grab this and let's just come here let's grab this aggressive nat king let's attack and let's just sit here blocking i'm going to glorify in this moment because it's very rare i get to glorify in anything in these particular games uh, let's go here. Let's push, 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 push. Let's push, 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 and give us a queen. No stalemates, please. Oops, it is. What have I done? There, okay. First decent game in the last. So this will uh, take us to. 52, 15, 52. Keep bouncing backwards and forwards within these 15 areas. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just go through some concentration moves now. Going to just take a break on here because I think there's quite a bit on this recorded. And then come back in and silent but hopefully deadly next moves.
50, 52, plus 6, 50, 58. Okay, so it's a slow process. Let's kick in again, next one. Ooh, 
liking that felt a little bit ferocious actually i have to look at the analysis see if there's any dips in that one okay so black's winning here yeah i realized as soon as i did this particular move i'm like oh damn it's got like a two on one type situation here um so i had to change tack and just simply just capture and then bring the bishop through so we lost out on that side yeah so it's rightly showing that black's winning here but i thought well just keep it calm and if we can get ownership of the file with the rooks and maybe we might stand a bit of a chance so we came and attacked and then they brought the bishop through which i thought was probably a bit of a problem for them i think the computers sort of showing otherwise as well i mean it's only showing minus 0.2 actually so it's not uh, a big thing but then bringing the bishop here i'm thinking maybe we can start putting some pressure on this bishop here so we captured just reducing down also taking away the support that the bishop had from the knight and then looking for an x-ray so we're not still winning at this moment in time it's minus 0.4 so capturing so i'm just wanting to reduce down i know some people say if you're down a piece or whatever you shouldn't really look at reducing down but i think it's looking at the position on the board i'm looking more in case of trying to get my rooks doubled up onto this bishop because there's going to be a weakness on the rooks either way so brought the king so then the movement of the king away really sort of like solidified potentially my attack towards this bishop and trying to own this file as best possible and the king moved further away so even the gauge bars agree and you know that was kind of not the right thing to do um it's got bishop don't know why the king wasn't coming back here but never mind so then at that point there it's just a matter of just grabbing the rook you still have the box clever you still got pieces on the board so we come through with the knight I'm not saying we did everything right i just want to see if there's major dips in this part here so they blocked their bishop and yes i was going to move the knight but i thought well might as well just take it's not caused it any problems plus 7.4 we are in that position and we dropped to 6.3 so actually bringing the knight back was the best thing why didn't i not want to do that let me see so coming back down oh yeah i thought his bishop was just going to escape yeah so here then his bishop just comes and escapes from this square this square here would that not work for them then okay let me just test that out yeah so bishop coming here so it's defended itself um I'm obviously not one to attack a piece that's actually got a defender on it so I probably wouldn't come with the rook and attack here I'd probably go to the far side and attack this pawn but yeah if that position arose where would I want I want my white square bishop doing something it just gives that bishop too much power I mean why is it saying attack the bishop when it's got protection on it nah I think I'll stick with what I did <laughs> thank you very much um, not that way yeah so we captured keeping it simple so we've got the bishop off the board it can no longer have any strength on this area here and then the rook can nicely use the power of the rook to just start taking pieces off the board finding nice positions just seeing if there's any dips at all it felt fairly okay yeah so that's fine yep good stuff another silent but hopefully deadly game so let's see where that's taken us to now i'm not even actually looking at the ratings of the people i'm playing it usually they're normally around about 1500s aren't they so 1558 plus 5 is uh, 1563 is that right yeah something like that, 63 oh we've got ages to go yeah crikey we're going to be going up and down up and down right let's go again
Do, 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 do. Let's just Oh, that's a quick description. another quick destruction my word cracky this silent but deadly well hopefully deadly things seems to be working a treat so far so that's 1563 plus four so uh, 1567 it's gonna take ages to get to 1600 maybe maybe i need to think about doing it tomorrow because i'm playing loads of games here wow that was a bit lethal but then when I'm doing these lethal games then it suddenly flips its head and the opponent's doing lethal games on me chess is so weird okay gonna pause this one just take a quick break slip there dude a bit of a slip <laughs> mm.
Ooh, that was a bit tight. Not yet, not yet, not yet. That was a mistimed hit, wasn't it? I saw it as well, you know. And I should, oh, I saw it and I should have just moved. In fact, why don't I just take? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I've messed it up. <laughs> Dear me. I said I was going to take there and it's stupid. I totally messed that one up. Concentration's gone. It's totally gone. I think I played too many games. Oh my days. Saw it as well. <sighs> What's that? Oh no. Oh, oh, oh no, 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 no. He missed that. <laughs> that was a golden opportunity. Oh dear me. Oh, dear, my concentration has, concentration has totally gone. Dear me. <laughs> oh, maybe we're aiming for the 1600 tomorrow. Dear me. and down the chest oh what we're doing <clears throat>
bit lucky, bit lucky, bit lucky. Uh, 1565, we're ending up at, at the minute. So, I suppose that's not too bad. The ups and downs, it's working for us. We'll take another break. Only 40 more points to get to um, 1600. Mm, pretty tasty. 